Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been urged to only return to the UK for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee if they can keep it quiet, a royal expert has said. Prince Harry, 37, and Meghan Markle, 40, have not made any clear indications on whether they will be returning to the UK to celebrate the Queen's 70 years of public service. But royal expert Jonathan Sacerdotti claimed it would probably be better if the Duke and Duchess of Sussex do not return and steal attention from the monarch. Speaking to Us Weekly's Royally Us, Mr. Sacerdotti said, I don't personally imagine Meghan coming to the UK very easily. She may prove me wrong but people here have such a low opinion of her if not of both of them these days that I think she would be very brave to come back to the UK. But I do still say that if they could come back and if they could not be front and center, keep it quiet but just come back to help celebrate not just for the Queen but for the whole country then that will probably be very nice and it might rehabilitate them somewhat towards the British people. I don't really think that's their style anymore. They don't like to do things quietly, they don't like someone else to be the center of attention when they're around and I think that where Harry and Meghan go, it's the Harry and Meghan show. It probably would be better if they didn't come and steal the limelight from the Queen. It comes as the Queen will not be seen as much as royal fans had hoped during the Jubilee, a royal expert has claimed. Daily Mail royal editor Rebecca English has since told Palace Confidential on Mailplus, the conversations they're having now around the Queen and the Jubilee are very different to the conversations they were having a year ago. A year ago they expected her to be front and center at everything, attending every event and that definitely is no longer the case. She will attend what they call, the big keynote events around the Jubilee in the run up to it and over the four day bank holiday weekend. But she definitely won't be attending everything. I'm told please don't let that be a cause for alarm. It's a simple fact of life at 95, you wake up with aches and pains you didn't have the day before. If she gets a cold, it will maybe knock her out of circulation a little bit longer than it would have done a year ago. These are celebrations of her historic anniversary and she will definitely be seen but just be warned it won't be quite as much as we had hoped. It comes as the Queen's royal aides have adopted a new strategy to stop royal fans panicking over the monarch's health after she was advised to rest. Royal expert Richard Kay explained the 95-year-old's health issues have caused concern for all royal fans since October. Speaking to True Royalty TV's Royal Beat, Mr. Kay said, they want to stop us panicking and there is panic whenever there is any illness relating to the Queen whatever the ailment is. You start get concerned and that was reflected in October. I think they're worried about a repeat of that.